This is Penny. She is our five-year-old Border Collie slash Blue Healer mix. We rescued her roughly five years ago. And as you can see now, she lives a very tough life. And today she's getting a brand new collar and not just any collar, she's getting a smart collar. This smart collar is made from a company named Phi and it's smart for a couple of reasons. And I'll get into that in just a minute here, but first let's unbox this quickly. And this might be the most pleasant unboxing experience I've ever had with any product. It's amazing what they did here. The outside looks like any other box that you would get, but once you rip off the pull tab on the front here, open it up, you can see they did some awesome things here. Just some really nice branding, really nice colors. Everything's very clear. There's instructions right on the box of what to do. Up front is the actual collar, and I'll get to that in just a second. You lift this up, you can see this is the charging station, and it connects via these pins, and it connects very easily. You just set it on there and it kind of fits right in. And then you also have the charging cords and then a wall adapter. And underneath that tab that you pulled up, there's more instructions of what you need to do next. You need to either use the QR code to download the app or just find it in the app store. And here's the collar itself. This thing feels extremely premium, very well made, has nice metal components, has nylon strap that feels very tough, it won't break. And the actual GPS part, it actually isn't as big as I thought it would be, which is very nice. You can choose between a couple different colors. We went with gray because we didn't want anything too flashy. And we got the medium sized one. Penny is about 45 pounds. She's a medium sized dog and the medium fits very well on her. Setup was really simple as well. You just start by creating an account and a profile for both yourself and your dog. You're then asked to plug in the base station and connect that to your Wi-Fi network. Next, you create a geofence around your yard so that if your dog leaves that area, it'll send a notification that your dog has left. And then lastly, you activate the collar by setting the collar onto the base station and beginning to charge it. In total, maybe five, 10 minutes to set this thing up. So let's go back to those features and why this is a smart collar and why you would want a smart collar. Because nano chipping is great, but it also requires someone to find your dog, bring them to a vet to scan the chip, and that doesn't always happen. First and foremost is that this has GPS tracking. So if your dog leaves that geofence that you create, then it pushes a notification to your phone saying, hey, Fido left the yard without an owner. You can then put the collar in loss mode, which will send you GPS coordinates of where the dog is so that you can run and find them quickly. And that's the main selling point, but there are some other features to this. There is a small LED on this collar so that when you go on night walks, this LED will blink and you can actually choose which color you want it to blink, which is kind of cool. You can customize it that way, but it's more of a safety light so that people can see your dog at night. It's also an activity tracker for your dog. So it'll track steps, mileage, walks, anything like that so that you can see how active your dog is being throughout the day. And lastly, you can connect with other dog owners and dogs by either taking pictures and uploading them to the app and seeing other people's pictures, or if your dog has an Instagram account, you can connect that to this as well. So let's talk a little bit more about that GPS tracking. So when you buy the Fi collar, if you don't buy a GPS plan, the collar will still work. It just has to be connected to either your Wi-Fi network or to your phone in order to track where your dog is. So if you take your dog for a walk with your phone on you, the collar will use the connected GPS with your phone and you can track how long the walk is, how many steps you took and that sort of thing. But if you don't get a GPS subscription, which you can purchase through the app, if your dog leaves your Wi-Fi network or leaves your phone connection range, then you won't be able to track your dog. GPS plans range from 186 for a two year plan or 248 for a three year plan. That's the pricing as of this review. So like I said, you can use this without a GPS plan, but it would make sense if you're buying a GPS collar to get a GPS plan, just in case your dog does get loose, you wanna be able to track them. And each dog, if you get two of these collars, each dog does need their own GPS plan. So that's kind of a bummer that if you have two dogs or multiple dogs and you wanna get collars for all of them, then you're gonna to have to get a GPS plan for all of them as well. Another cool thing is that you can invite other owners of the dog or dog walkers to join the app and be a part of the dog's profile. And this is cool because if you have a dog walker that comes during the day, you can see when they come and they take your dog for a walk, it'll tell you so-and-so picked up your dog and they're on a walk right now and you can actually track them via GPS, how far they went, where they went, and when they returned home. Another great thing is that the alerts are totally customizable as well. You can get a notification when your dog leaves the safe zone, AKA your yard, or when they start a walk with someone or end a walk with someone, or when they reach their activity goals, someone likes their photo on the app, low battery notifications. There's a lot that you can customize here. 
And I've been using this Phi collar for, I, I should say, Penny has been using this collar for a while now. And overall, I'm just extremely impressed with this. First and foremost is the build because you can have all these great features, but if the collar is not built well or falls off easily or breaks easily, then none of that matters. This thing is built extremely well, probably the most well-built collar I've ever had for a dog. It's IP68 rated, meaning that you don't have to worry about this thing getting wet or your dog going swimming with it on or it getting dirty. Penny and I have gone on some cold walks with it and no issues whatsoever. The notifications and everything works perfectly so far on it. Anytime I take Penny for a walk, it recognizes that and tracks it. Anytime that Penny has left the yard or the geofence without an owner, it quickly tells us. And the app has been really great as well. The home screen is very cool. It kind of gives you a timeline of what your dog did throughout the day. It'll show you live of where your dog is and what it's doing. And the rest of it is just so easy to use and very intuitive and easy to understand. And honestly, it's fun to use. Battery life is kind of all over the board. Now they quote one to three months, but that depends on a lot of things. Mainly if you're using GPS a lot. So if your dog is getting out a lot and you put the color in loss mode where it's tracking the dog's GPS position all the time, it's gonna run out of batteries a lot faster. Whereas if your dog is home a lot or within your Wi-Fi network or connected to a phone, it's gonna last a lot longer. I'm showing about a one to 2% drop in battery life per day. So that one to three months in battery life is holding up right now. However, Penny hasn't gotten out or gotten lost in that time frame, so we haven't had to use the onboard GPS on the collar. So again, if you have to use that, that's gonna drastically reduce the battery life. A couple things I wish were a little bit better. One is the geofencing. If you have a small yard or you live in an urban area like I do, you have to have a certain minimum radius around your house. And the minimum radius was pretty big compared to what our house and yard is. So our geofence contains some of our neighbor's yards, some streets. So we don't get notification that Penny is gone until she leaves that. So she could be a half a block down before we would get a notification. So I do wish that you can tighten that up a little bit to accommodate smaller yards or make it a little bit more customizable. Another is the having to have two GPS plans if you have two dogs. We do have two dogs. I'd love to get another one for the other dog, but purchasing another really expensive $150 collar and then having to spend another $200, $250 in GPS plans. I mean, you're talking a lot of money for GPS tracking for two dogs. Luckily for us, the other dog is a 15-year-old pug, so she's going nowhere fast. But overall, I just really love this collar. I love the look of it. I think the GPS tracking is obviously great, but the light that comes on at night if you go for night walks is very nice. The activity tracking to kind of keep track of how active your dog is being is also very great. Overall, there's just a lot to love here. And I'd recommend this to two types of dog owners. One, if you have a dog that's really good at escaping, and two, if you're someone that works in an office all day and you just want to make sure that your dog is staying active and the dog walker is coming and taking them for a walk every day. So check it out. I'll put a link in the description below. Thanks for watching, guys. For myself and for Penny, we're out of here. Catch you on the next video.